Oh, I great. couldn't even really drive. Chris is like, what? Is this? It just makes my eyes go in and out of focus or something. Oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah why is it bad anyway? Anyway, guys, we're back with Bumper, so I've got to tell you, I love this little dog. So I've got the pager only collar on in the sense we forgot. Oh, no, we got the leash on. What, what you're going to do always, and this is the only collar we ever really have for them. They might have a puppy collar, uh, but you know, just a flat collar, but we never use a chain, we never use a prong collar, and we gotta do that. Mm -hmm. collar. Yeah. Always just using the pager. It's the most fascinating way to communicate. And it, it's gonna help you oh let's not leave this. I'm a contradiction that the dog trim goes on like this one. <laughs> So what I want to do is, again, if I'm going to do the, I want the dog to understand I can guide you with the pager and the leash, and that those two things are not mutually exclusive by any means, you know, by any means. Doing that, I can start having my precursors down. I'm just going to hold my hand up there. It's not going to occur to me in my way. Actually, we'll teach a down just like that, but that's the way I've been doing it. He didn't have the muscle memory to go down from that angle. But if I want to start adding my pager, all I've got to do is this. my pager. I got my collar on the back of my neck. Thank you. 